Good morning everyone! Today I have a class in the ceramic workshop where we'll be glazing clay. So I'm gonna take you with me and show you this process. And these are the tiles that I made previously. If you're interested, you can check out other videos where I made them. And unfortunately, I couldn't finish one of them and it misses a few details because I didn't know that you need to cover your clay object to continue working with it later. So they just baked it. But I guess now I have the experience and know what to do the next time. Now I'm cleaning the surface with the wet sponge and I do it to smooth the surface so that the glaze can cover everything more evenly. And then using a sanding sponge I'm smoothing the surface even better. And so I'm doing it until I'm satisfied, but it's really hard to stop because you want it to be perfect. But actually I think that clay is about imperfections so being imperfect is something that you can show through clay and clay doesn't have to be perfect Actually, something that I didn't think would take so much time is just mixing this glaze with water because you need the right consistency and it just took so much time and like I changed from stick to knife to a big knife <laughs> so yeah 
As for colors, I decided to choose blue and brown and what I'm mixing right now is actually blue, but it looks gray. Uh, but it's gonna become blue after baking and I chose this particular color because um, this paint was developed in Egypt. It's like the technique that is used for making this glaze right now is the same as it was in Egypt thousands of years ago and that made me so curious because it's just so amazing as I think to combine this kind of Asian traditional paint with something modern and uh, abstract like that my tile it looks abstract and yeah it just made me so excited to try uh, this combination of these two things <laughs> The tile is mostly gonna be blue, but this kind of volumetric stripes are gonna be brown on top at some parts, but not every stripe. So yeah, you're gonna see it later, I think, when it is baked, but not in this video. So <laughs> subscribe to see what the result is, because right now it just looks kind of the same as it was. But after baking, it's gonna become really bright. So I'm just really interested how it's gonna look. Okay. 